any questions back there? I have two questions. First, you mentioned that this is a key threat to our economy, strategy, and security. What I'd say to the average Floridian is uh, your state government takes uh, the security of this state very uh, seriously. And there's a lot that the federal government needs to do, of course, and that goes for our border, which is a total disaster and it's gonna get worse this week. Uh, and it goes to having a strong military, it goes to protecting Americans from Chinese influence in the economy and make sure we have more economic self-sufficiency. And there's a lot that's been derelict over the years with that. And I think what we can tell Floridians is we're getting ahead of things. As you start to see what the CCP is doing, with the farmland, we reacted very quickly. Also with all the other critical infrastructure. And so this is the strongest in the country. Uh, I think people instinctively realize uh, when you have a junta, a ruling junta dedicated to communist ideology like the CCP, uh, that's not someone you want in your backyard. And that's not somebody that is gonna be productive uh, operating in the state of Florida. And so today we say no. Uh, and that's not going to happen here. And I hope all states follow suit and follow Florida's lead.